Welcome back guys, Angel of the Night here. We are back with more Blueberry Prologue competition battles. And as you can see, we are now number 4060. We've actually made a good turnaround here. We are up against a team here that looks pretty nasty, let's be honest. There is a Terrapagos, a Cobalion evolution, not an evolution, sorry, Paradox form. Um, there is a Rillaboom Incineroar. There is a Raging Bolt and a Primarina. Now, I'm going to be honest, I really want to bring Swampert to this, but that Rillaboom, I could almost guarantee, is going to come in here, and I don't think we will survive any kind of a hit from that thing. I think we are going to have to try to outspeed that, at least with a Walking Wake. Um, let's go ahead and choose him. Oop, actually, let's go Whimsicott and Incineroar. That is our main primary goal here. And then, of course, we're going to choose these as well. Um, his Raging Bolt could be a problem for us. But, actually, I do want, I do really want to bring Swampert. Locking it in. Locking it in. Let's play and live dangerously here, guys. Um, honestly, that Raging Bolt could be a big problem. I don't know if they're going to bring it, but I have a feeling that we are going to see it at some point. Uh, whether it's going to be at the beginning or at the end, we don't know. Okay, so it looks like it's going to be the beginning of the battle. Now, will I be able to outspeed his Incineroar? That is going to be a good question here. We get the attack drop here with the Intimidate. He's also going to get his Intimidate off here because obviously there's no other reason to use Incineroar. We want to get that. Uh, he's got the Protosynthesis. That's going to boost up his uh, special attack there. Of course, with it being max, it's probably well over 200, close to 300 there at level 50. I think what we will have to do... I'm going to go for the Dazzling Gleam here because both Pokemon will be hit. I'm going to have to go for the fake out here. We've got to fake out his Incineroar. Okay, we went with the Dazzling Gleam because we wanted to get some damage off onto the Raging Bolt. Now, of course, with the fake out occurring and the Dazzling Gleam, we got some decent damage off onto the two opposing Pokemon. Now, we can go for it here again. We've been able to outspeed them prior. So, one thing I could also do as well is get the Tailwind up. I might need to do that at some point, but for now, we're going to go for another Dazzling Gleam. For the Incineroar, we're not going to worry too much about him. We're going to go for the knockoff onto the Raging Bolt. Raging Bolt is the biggest threat here, so we want to get him taken out as fast as possible. There's a Dragon Pulse we should be able to survive, which we do. And we outspeed his Incineroar. Unfortunately, we don't get this thing taken out. Now, next thing is, he's going to go for the priority move. Let's go for the Tailwind. And this time... We're going to go for the knockoff onto the Incineroar. Okay, he's going to go for the Protect. Obviously, it was good for us to do this. He did not go for the Thunderclap, though. Okay, that's okay. Whimsicott is down. That's fine. The next Pokemon we're going to bring in here is Terrapagos. There is no way... Well, actually, I could bring in Walking Wake. If I go for Walking Wake and go for the Protect, I can then go for the attack onto the Raging Bolt. And then next turn, I could go in for the attack onto the Incineroar. But if I had brought in Terrapagos, I was definitely going to get hit for sure. So, let's go for the Protect. 
And then we're going to go for the knockoff onto the Raging Bolt. He's going to swap out his Incineroar. Probably smart play for him. Although that's going to be bad for us later on because we're going to actually have an Intimidation. Okay, there's the Thunderclap. Can't hit the um, Walking Wake. So here we go. We actually take him out in that situation. Now, we are going to have to worry about Prime Arena here a little bit. So I'm likely going to have to go for the Parting Shot. We knew that was going to happen. Now, can I get a second Protect off here? Well, I should go for the Hydra Stream while I Hydra Steam while I can. And let's go for that parting shot onto the pre marina. Okay, that's okay. Let's get the parting shot. Come on. Yeah, buddy. Attack and special attack fell. Now if it does go for like a dazzling gleam or something like that, it might not do as much damage as I am expecting it to. Or a moon blast. I don't really want to lose hydro. Oh, not hydro, but walking wake. Sorry, my brain just went. Okay, we transform Terra Pagos. That's fine. Dazzling gleam. Okay, Terra Shell. Distorting type matchups. That's fine. We survive, which means now we can actually go for an attack the next turn. Hydra Stream. Hydra Steam, not Stream, Corey. Come on. Let's go for the Terrestrialization and the Terra Storm. Now, will he swap out his Incineroar or will he swap out his Pre Marina? Now, I do have to remember he still has his Raging Bolt in behind with the Thunderclap. So we have to make sure that we have a smart play for that, too. Hydra Steam. There we go. We got the Incineroar taken out, which is awesome. Now we just have two Pokemon remain. I think. There's the Terra Star Storm. Will this be enough? Probably not. That's a decent hit. Dazzle, dazzle. Okay, Walking Wake is now gone. That's okay. Okay, Incineroar, come on in there, buddy. Now, we'll fake out work on the Raging Bolt with a Thunderclap. Oh, shoot. I forgot about his own Terrapagos. Yikes. That's not good. Okay. Um, let's go for the fake out. And Calm Mind. Let's go for a Calm Mind. That's okay. We're not going to attack that thing anyway. He did not go for the Terra Change. And that's okay. Okay, call mine. That's going to boost up our stats. Specifically, our special attack and our special defense. Going to play it a little safe there. I think we did pretty well. Okay, got a little bit of lefties there. That's always good. Let's go for the parting shot and the Terra Star Storm. Okay, he's going to go for his own stellar Terra type.
Okay, we are gonna lose Incineroar. That, uh, Incineroar, yeah, that's fine. This won't be enough to take out his Terrapagos, but it might do a decent amount. Ho ho ho! Wow! That's interesting. Oh. Where does to be we already took out his raging bolt. I have lost track of the battle. That doesn't happen very often, but he is faster than me this time. That's okay, but we should be able to get the Terra Star Storm to finish him off. And that is going to be game. Right on. Loving day two matches already. I am loving this. This is great. All right, guys, if you enjoyed the battle, you know what to do. Hit that like button. Be sure to post your comments in the comment section below. I'd like to hear from you guys what you guys thought, what you enjoyed, what you didn't enjoy. How did I lose track of the battle? I don't know. Take care. Have a good one. And peace out.